What's good, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Charles. And I'm Alyssa. And guys, we are at the most expensive buffet in the Philippines. I'm excited. Yeah, we waited all day for this, baby. We did not eat. We did not do anything. We waited for this. Yeah, so this buffet is in a hotel. It's called the... Sophie? Sophie? I don't know. I guess Rihanna and Chris Brown used to stay at this hotel. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fun fact. Like, Someone told me that. I was like, oh, that's cool. But that was like 20 years ago. <laughs> yeah, so like what made it funny was like, we was like, wait, if you say Rihanna and Chris Brown, that's like when I was like in middle school. In middle school time. Yeah, but hey, man, <laughs> Rihanna and Chris Brown, y'all need to get back out to the Philippines, bro. I don't think ASAP like that. <laughs> oh, yeah, true, 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 true. This is so nice. Look at this oh. staircase, babe. Yeah, so this is why it's called by the spiral because of the staircase. This is the buffet. Shit, big as hell. This is so cool. So, my man didn't make reservations. Whoa, 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 whoa. We did not have to have reservations. Well, she nope. asked if we did. She asked, but we didn't have to. And it was costing us 4,900 pesos for this buffet. Oh, this is my. so nice. Yeah, it's a nice so little restaurant. By the way, guys. Alyssa wants some Chardonnay. I don't want no Chardonnay. I'm gonna taste it and see. You know what you're supposed to do? I didn't think you did it a little. You gotta swirkle it around. You don't know that? Yeah. Oh, I'm taking advice from the professional wine drinker. Yes. In the camera. He drank like one glass of wine in his life. <laughs> It's so much stuff. Okay. Over here you got pasta. Oh my god. Oh my god, this looks so good. Oh, good. Look at the spaghetti. I love spaghetti like that. Okay, now this is okay, now this is a lot. Can't even lie. I don't know where to start. I, I'm leaving you. No, you're not. Babe, this tempura is calling my name. We're just looking. We don't know what to get first. It says cut here. Oh no. Yes, sir. That's my tattoo. Oh, I like it. Yes, sir. I'm a bad boy. You He's said a you're a bad, bad boy? boy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I like it. I like it. We'll be back. Trust me. Babe, what does I'm a bad boy mean? He's a bad boy. Oh my gosh, I'm, that looks so good. I'm for sure starting with that. We got Super pizza good. over here. Pizzas. Oh my god. Damn, they got hella stuff. I feel like a little kid at the candy store. Oh There's my more. god, they got sushi. Oh, this, uh, is, this is our area right uh, here, babe. Hi, hi. Hi. Oh my god. This is really hard. I like want to get a plate so bad yeah. and start like packing it on. Okay, I think that's what I'm gonna do then. That's it what keeps I'm gonna do. on going. Oh, that's too damn big. All right, I'm gonna start here, y'all, with some blue crab. Yes, yes. And can I have some shrimp? My mouth is watering. Of course, we would start with something like this, right? Yeah, but the only problem is, like, I'm all for it. They're just little. All time favorite is crab. I've just got in a blue crab recently. The best. All right, so I got some of this pasta. I'm so excited to try it. Mine's is gone. You ready? Oh. I know what you're about to say. It's not warm. But it's actually really good. It's very good. It's just cold. They're out there singing, boy. They... This must be the spot everyone goes to for their birthdays. Not only are they waiters, they're singers. He asked me that I want some more. This is so I had a good. little bit. I think I might get some more. He had none. We took the last of it. They have to make more. We just started eating. What? It was really good. Now let's try this blue crab. I honestly don't like when it's cold. It's probably so, it's so little. Do you even taste the meat? The shrimp is good. Shit, damn, they're decent. Babe, yeah. the shrimp is so good. I know you don't like cold shrimp, but it's so good. Okay. It's like fresh, like out the ocean. I don't know. I know you don't like cold uh, crab, but I'm going to let you taste this, okay? And I want you to tell me your honest opinion. Honest opinion. Honest opinion. Honest opinion. Wow, you would not think it's that small. That small? Yeah. But what I'm saying, what do you think about it though? It's very good. It's like damn near top of the line. It tastes expensive, like like an expensive crab. They cooked it perfectly. Oh god. And it has like, well, I don't know if it's the butter, but the flavor is really good too. Yeah. I'm shocked. For those of you out there wondering how much this was, it was four thousand nine hundred. 
$199. No, pesos. <laughs> Wait, it ain't dollars. Not dollars, it's pesos. Sorry. So how much is that? Uh, I want to say like around $90. Which honestly... That's not a lot. In the U.S., something like this would be like almost $200 yeah. a person. Yeah. So it's actually like... And honestly, you're not getting that much food I, I, even at a $200 spot. It's a pretty good deal. Yeah. For that money though, I'm for sure you eating, know the crab. eating every little part of my meal, like The crab's gonna be gone in like 10 minutes. No one's gonna be able to get any because Charles is gonna eat it all. I'm for sure going back, continuing to go back, go back. The waiters are super nice too because I keep seeing them trying to come over here. Yeah, they're on their ish. Yeah. So for this round, I got sushi. Mm -hmm. I asked for every single roll up there. So we're about to try it. What'd you get, babe? Oh. I got more. Oh. Yeah. I told you he's about to eat crab all night. <laughs> Be honest now. That was really good. Really? It kind of reminded me of the rainbow roll. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. That's what's up. Actually, try one of those purple ones, please. No. Yeah, here, have some. Ah. That's good. Don't it's not lie. bad. Okay, so I got some pizza. This is a vegetable pizza. Oh, and I'm about some mussels. Oh my god, this is good. Let me know right now. Let me know right now. Let me know right now. I love mussels. Like this? Mmm. It needs a little juice. I never liked that as a kid. Even as a grown up, sometimes I'm like, ugh, it's too big, but like, that's actually really good. That one was juicier. I like yeah. it. Yeah. For real though, what would you rate this? Like dead ass. So far, I give it a 10. I've finished everything so far. I don't know what it is about the Philippines. They give you like the right amount of portions. Now here we go to try this different multi-colored juicy one that you said was delicious. You know it's good. I finished my pizza. This is one of them ones where you like, you don't always want to agree with your girl, but... Just agree with your girl because she's always right. I said this one of them ones where you don't always want to, but... You, she got it. Okay, now it's like, what, what do I get next? Let's let her sit for a little bit. Let's play okay. a game. Let's play a game. Let's play Never Have I Ever. Never have I ever farted in public. You can't say that because you have. I haven't. <laughs> I haven't. Starting this game off so... <laughs> okay, so it got to be something that I've never done. That you've never done. Oh, never have I ever farted in public and blamed it on somebody else. <laughs> Talking about farting. I just thought it was funny. Okay. I always blame other people. It's never the bad bitch. <laughs> we just talked about that. Yeah, okay, okay. Never have I ever cheated. Never have I ever said I love you and didn't mean it. <laughs> wait, wait, who do you have you said you love you to well, okay, and mean it? People say love you and you like just met them or like to like some like aunts and stuff that like oh, I don't really love yeah. like you know what I mean? like that sounds so mean the family members like you don't have any relationship to and they like you see them like once every 20 years and they're like I love you and you're like love you oh question god mark, oh god because I got some, I got some people like that too I got some people like that too I don't like saying I love you to someone or to anyone if I don't truly love them but I have done it before just to be nice yeah 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 because like what do you say when people are like love you and you're like love you too like <laughs> I just feel like you have to say it backwards yeah. through, you know? Right, yeah. Never have I ever got suspended. For what? I got suspended so many times in school. Like, I got suspended one time on the second day of school for calling my teacher to, to be work. And then I got suspended, for like, you know, I got in like a fight in third grade. I remember one time I got suspended for calling my teacher to be work. Uh -huh. And then went back to school the next day, I got suspended for fighting. My mom spanked me with my I'm ass. so scared with to my have ass, kids. Bro. I, I hope they're know. like me. No, they're going to be like you. They're going to be like me too. I'm, I'm good. Well, I had a couple of hiccups, you know. You got to have a couple of hiccups to be the good person. You wasn't always perfect. I didn't really have any hiccups. <laughs> Okay, Alyssa. Your turn. Never have I ever lied to the police to get out of a ticket. 
I've never lied to the police to get out of jail. Because I know for a fact they were taking my ass when, I, when they pulled me over. See, I got pulled over twice my whole life, and actually three times. And I always had an excuse, and they never gave me a ticket. I've never got a parking ticket, a speeding ticket, nothing. Look, I need a knock on wood. Yeah, yeah, you might want to knock on wood. <laughs> oh, no, no, you're lying. No, wait, wait, wait. I never got a ticket. No, you got a ticket. What? You know that one time in Arizona when you got that ticket in the mail? And it <laughs> Oh, and you were driving shit. and it showed your face and you was like, <laughs> I was like, Alyssa, who is this? She was like, it wasn't me. <laughs> like, remember that? I don't that count those. That was so funny. I don't count those only because I didn't get pulled over. Oh you know, my. the cop didn't get me. It was the, the camera that got me. It was the light. You know how many we got? Like, I remember like one week and it wasn't even us. His brother took his car and got a ticket. Your other friend got a ticket in it. We had so many speeding tickets come in the mail, but... Hey, never have I ever been to jail. Actually, why did I put that down? I haven't. I'm be oh, wait, oh. My man is a bad boy. No, I ain't. I'll tell anybody and everybody, don't do nothing that's gonna make you <laughs> go to jail. Straight up, because it ain't where you want to be. I was in jail was in like jail. 2000. I don't know, remember. But boy, 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 it wasn't a good feeling. It's being in there in that cell with them people. Mm -hmm. Why don't you just clarify what you were in jail for? Uh, I got to a fight in Arizona with a dude, a white dude called me a, a nigga. And it was when I was in college, but it was like a random dude, like at Walmart. And I went to jail for like a day and a half. But I was in like the real jail in Arizona. Oh, thank, thank you so you. much. Thank you. They but made like, more of these for me in the back. But I was in there, I was um in there with like people that like did real shit. You know what I'm saying? Even though that was real. But then I got to the court the next day, the, the judge <laughs> threw it out, got out later that night. All no. right, we have one more. We got one. <laughs> okay, eat. No, no, it's fine. No, no, honestly, because we was waiting on your food to come. What are these again? Tempura? Yeah. Oh. I ate all the shrimp already. <laughs> A little light on the shrimp, huh? This is so good, right? It's not bad. It ain't really my cup of tea. I'm not a shrimp person like you say. I'm really hungry, but I'm scared to get up. You ever been scared to get up at a buffet? Seriously, think about it. You ever been scared to get up at a buffet? I haven't, personally, but my brother used to be always scared because he was always insecure about his weight. Yeah. So some people, I'm sure, have that insecurity, but I don't. I got that insecurity. I'm like, no. I'm hungry and I paid for this. I'm All right, eating. I'm going again. <laughs> I'm going. Bye. Okay, guys. I'm feeling the wine okay. a little bit. Hold on, hold on. Look at it. I didn't even get that much, and look how much I have left. I already feel tipsy. Mm -hmm. I don't drink anymore like I used to. But this food here is so good. Right. I I Can I just have some of this? I'm kind of craving something That's sweet. It. Like, I want to get some fruit and some dessert. Look at this. Oh, what? What? Listen, oh God, I want to try some. Give me the camera and taste this right now. This is like sour gummy worms, right? Taste it now. Taste it. I don't. I've never had that candy before. These taste like the octopuses. I was just talking about. I want some like something sweet. Oh really? Can I turn? That shit's good as hell. Oh my god. This is up our alley, babe. I feel like one of them dudes who be doing the food videos. Oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> Literally going nuts over the candy. Right. Now, candy at a buffet. I ain't heard of that. Look at this. Me and you. You said me and you. <laughs> <laughs> this looks so good. You know what would be good? Marshmallow. Marshmallow. Strawberry hey. too. Can I get a marshmallow dipped in chocolate? Ooh. Thank you so much. And can I do one of each? I want my own. <laughs> can I do one more of that? <laughs> you can have one of me. Thank you. I feel like I want some ice cream, but I think I might have to come back for it. Oh, you want to eat it here? Yes. That's good as hell. Wait, what? 10 out of 10. I'm yeah. the vanilla now. Oh, God. Oh, my God. And I don't like vanilla, and that's really good. Any event that we have, we have to have that. Yes. Let's have some ice cream. Okay. We're at the ice cream session, y'all. I want the mango. What do you want? Uh, cookie and cream and mango. Oh, gosh. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Oh, <laughs> we. What you think first? It's not what I was expecting, but it's like really Try this. good. Try this. That's really good. It's not bad. I don't, I think we just discovered new. Oh my god. Cookies and cream and mango ice cream. Oh my god. It's not as 
sweet as I thought it would be, but it's still very good. What would you call this? Cookies and mango? It's good as hell. Oh my God. It's better than yours, I don't know. See, now, don't I always come with the best? The best, uh, Sometimes, yes, you do. I'll no. give it to you. See, it comes with the combinations. I'll, 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 I'll tell I feel you like that. I'm, I feel like I'm like a fat kid at heart. He's like 85 to 90% accurate half the time. Like, I approve. Oh, no, the combinations? Yeah. He's definitely opened my mind to new foods, like mixing foods together, seasonings, like... I don't know if everybody know what I just did there, <laughs> but obviously I'm a little seasoned. Mm -hmm. And I put you on a salt and pepper, right? No. Yes, I did. I don't like salt and pepper, but you put but me. But you be put, you be like liking salt and pepper. Babe, I ain't gonna lie, you just fit a stereotype out of this world. <laughs> they say white people, all y'all do is put salt and pepper, and that's it. Yeah, that's all. That's like well, that's how I was raised. Put salt and pepper on it. It's good. Yeah, but you gotta add more seasoning. We do hella good seasoning at our house, me and you. We don't just do no salt and pepper at our house. He seasons all my food, except the stew. I, I season that pretty well. Yeah, you do a good job seasoning now. You don't like our kids won't be just eating salt and pepper. Some days they might, okay? I some pray. days they might. They're gonna be like, they're gonna be like, Dad, Mom's trying to kill us. No, someday I'm gonna make them mac and cheese and they're gonna have salt and pepper on it. Yeah, well, okay. What else do you like season mac and cheese with? Yeah, you're right. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. It's so good. All right, y'all, so we are completely finished with our meal. In full. I'm yeah. so full. I feel like I'm about to bust out of these jeans. I'm ready to go home and sleep. Yeah, so we love you. Thank you guys for watching. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll see you in the next one. Adios. Adios.